This is Mike. I am in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina visiting Sparks Toyota and I'm checking out a 2016 Toyota Avalon in the XLE trim level at night. So we're going to check out all the interior and exterior lighting in this vehicle. So right now I have the parking lights on. So you have the, the, the option of daytime running lights off and then automatic feature and then this is the parking lights. So this is, so you have an amber light there on the side as well as here in the front. And then this is actually the place where the high beams normally shine, which is more of a, a dim light right now. And that's also the daytime running lights as well. Let's take a look here in the back. So the taillights have, taillights have a combination of LEDs, which you can see right now, and standard bulbs, which we'll see in a second. And there's your light for your tag. And you notice it illuminates the ground quite well, so you can kind of help with the approach of the vehicle. So let's take a look at the turn signal. You see the amber light flashing there in the, the bottom. You also have a flashing light here on the side mirror, which is visible all the way around. And there's your tail light. So now I have the low beams on, and you can see that they have two on each side projector tubes powered by halogen bulbs. And you see it has two on each side, so gives you a nice tight focus beam for the low beams. Let's see if we can see what that looks like. Try to give you a first person view here. So there's your low beams and there's your high beams. So there's low and then there's high. So now I have the high beams on. So not only do you have the two projector tubes illuminated, but now you have this very bright high beam in the reflector housing, which gives you more of a flood light here in the front of the vehicle. Let's see what it looks like now with the high beams on. Okay, let's go ahead and start taking a look on the inside of the vehicle, starting here with the trunk. Go ahead and open it up. See what's inside. So the trunk is illuminated by a single light right here, which gives you kind of a soft moonlight throughout the entire trunk. And since it's a black interior trunk, it's kind of hard to focus, so I'm trying to focus on that white paper there but you can actually see pretty good here in the trunk it's really hard to pick up with the camera but you can see pretty good I mean it's not super bright but uh, but you can see in here pretty good hopefully that gives you an idea of the different light intensities in the in the trunk there let's take a look here in the back seat oh yeah all right there's the inside of the back door we have a backlit power window button here and there's the back seats now the back seats are illuminated by these two uh, lights there in the center and they are also tap lights so in case they need a quick reading light or something they can you know quickly tap that and get a light floorboards illuminated seats are illuminated looking all good back here all right time to take a look in the front oh yeah Okay, so the front door actually has a pedal light. So the pedal light will illuminate your approach as you walk up. And you have some backlit buttons here for the power windows, the door locks, and the side mirror controls are all backlit. So there's your interior lighting, which is doing a pretty, pretty good job of illuminating everything. When you open up the doors, you have the lights there and here on. And with the light interior, kind of helps out a lot as well. Okay, here we are on the inside. Just kind of looking around with the interior lights on. Seeing what we have. So the door's open. Let me go ahead and shut the door so we can see what it looks like with the interior lights off. Oh yeah, this is nice. You have all the backlit buttons here. You have some there on the left side. Here on the steering wheel. Even the cruise control down here is illuminated. That's pretty neat. 
so here's your gauges and the gauges are very well illuminated and the colors are awesome you've got that blue and the white lettering popping out there really looking good so over here with your touch screen you have all these backlit buttons all up and down climate control let's take a look in this little compartment where your uh, input for your radio and you have some power supplies that's illuminated in there there's your shifter cup holders heated seat controls and your drive controls there now the center armrest and the console here is dark so let's go ahead and let me kind of turn the night shot on so you can see inside here there we go okay so we can see in here that is there's no lights so we're just kind of showing you what's in the dark so you can at least know what where I'm aiming the camera but uh and then the floorboard there is is dark there's no ambient light in the floorboards okay so let me turn the uh night vision off so up here we have some uh, tap lights that you can turn on individually and then you have your backlit buttons here this button will actually turn on all the interior lights like so Your visors, mirrors, and lights there. All right, glove compartment time. Yeah, so it's all black in the glove compartment, but it does have a little light in there, so you can kind of see. Good thing there's a piece of paper in there to kind of show you what it looks like, uh, because the the black carpeting kind of absorbs all the light, so. It does have a light in there, and you can see in there fairly well, considering. Let's go ahead and put it in reverse so we can see what the backup camera looks like. Oh yeah, you can see really good. With the reverse lights and everything, and also the camera helps adjust for the lighting, so that helps out. Alright, there you have it. 2016. Toyota Avalon at night. Really awesome vehicle. So if you have any questions or anything, leave it in the comment section. And I'll see you guys next time.